So let's start the way we always do. We started off as uh, sit and sit dog training in Northern Virginia, and then we felt that we needed to expand and get a little bit bigger, so we started the Caring Angels of Northern Virginia. And my youngest daughter had joined the Air Force and she was deployed, and she got hurt. And when she came home, she was a very different kid. We went out to Arlington Cemetery. There was a soldier there with a white golden retriever. And that was honestly the first time I saw I saw a spark in my daughter. So I got it in my head that I was going to go home and buy her a service dog. And at the time, I had no idea. I wasn't a dog trainer, and I thought you could just go and get a service dog, and here you go, and now you're good. And then I discovered it's not that easy. And for the military, sometimes it's hard. Her dog, uh, his name is Major, and the only, the only way that I know to describe it is that's the only reason she gets out of bed. That's the dog that she focuses on. That's the dog that gets her through the night terrors. That's the dog that she takes to work. That dog is her best friend. The beauty about a dog is not only is it loyal, but it doesn't, it doesn't pass judgment. We started creating service dogs as well, which is an honor. We do all the basic obedience, and then we donate them to the military, depending on what they need. PTSD, balanced dogs. So when we placed Dee Dee with Ian, uh, his family is incredible. The support system that he has is amazing. Everyone understands her job is to be with, with Ian all the time. I met Dee Dee at Walter Reed and heard that there was a symposium going on and that they were going to have some dogs. I introduced myself, my son and I, we started talking with Dee Dee. And then I found myself that I was laying on the floor with the dog. And um, I'd been going through a hard time at that point. My home dynamics are better because she just gives this tranquility to any environment that we're in. And it's especially apparent at home. She gave me back something that I didn't have, which was peace. I sleep better at night. She wakes me up when I'm having a nightmare. I don't have this high anxiety anymore. She's just been so great. And I've had the best time ever because I can always look at my hip and she's there. She's there with me at work, at school, at the store, at my kids' practices, anywhere. She's with me, she's, she's my backup. The best kind of backup there is. She, all she wants is just unconditional love and food. <laughs>